I now call upon His Excellency Mohammad Higazi, Ambassador of Egypt to India. Chairman Mr. Jinder Singh, Secretary of Information Technology, Government of <coughs> India, Mr. Nitin Desai, distinguished panelists, respected audience, excellencies, ladies and gentlemen. It is a pleasure to be here with you today at the closing ceremony of the third Internet Governance Forum in Hyderabad. On behalf of His Excellency Dr. Tariq Kamel, Minister of Communications and Information Technology of Egypt, who unfortunately was unable to join your distinguished gathering. Allow me at the outset, on behalf of the government and the people of Egypt, to convey our deep condolences to the families of the victims of the Mumbai criminal attacks and express our solidarity with India and its great people. I would like also to extend words of gratitude to our generous host for their warm hospitality and congratulate them on the excellent organization of this event. Our special word of recognition go to Chairman Nitin Desai, Mr. Marcus Kuma, all members of the IGF Multi-Stakeholders Advisory Group for their enormous effort in arranging this dynamic, stimulating, and interactive meeting. With the Internet being always on the top priority of the Egyptian government's agenda, Egypt has been actively participating in the IGF process since its initiation, believing in its potential of the Internet for socioeconomic development as well as the opportunities it brings to individual and the society at large. Egypt has actively participated in the two phases of the WSIS and was an early member of the Working Group on Internet Governance, WGIG, which initiated the idea of the formation of the IGF. Before the first IGF meeting in Athens, we took the lead to coordinate an African stance through gathering all African partners in discussing issues of interest and develop coordinated positions. During each of the three IGF phases, Athens, Rio, and now in India, Egypt was keen to take part in the different functions of the three forums, part, uh, partnering with various stakeholders. Today in Hyderabad, we are witnessing another phase in the progress of the IGF with the process getting into maturity stage. It gives me great feeling of satisfaction to follow the deliberations taking place between partners who all gather with one aim in mind, to shape the cyber world for the benefit of the whole community. Eventually, the cyber world is not anymore another parallel world to our real one, as everything now that happened online maps itself in our actual day-to-day -day life with its positive or negative impact on our lives. Thanks to IGF, we are all proud to be more capable of understanding the problems that lies ahead, of identifying the challenges and opportunities we have had, and of being more efficient in propping into the Internet issues. The theme of our meeting here in Hyderabad, Internet for All, mirrors our mature vision and the strong conviction of all stakeholders taking part in this process that the Internet should be for all. 